EVI breakaway reconnection demonstration. Inspect each half of the separator breakaway for obvious damage to the outer shell, plastic inserts, or O-rings that may affect reconnecting the two halves. After completing inspection, lightly lubricate the main O-ring on the top half of the breakaway. Any weight motor oil is acceptable. Slide the top clamp of the breakaway reconnection clamp onto the two flat surfaces on the top half of the breakaway. Align the dowel pin in the bottom half of the breakaway with the dowel pin guide located in the top half of the breakaway. When the dowel pin and the guide are aligned, continue squeezing the tool grip until the breakaway halves come together. Caution: Reconnection can cause a small amount of gasoline to leak out of the breakaway. A towel wrapped loosely around the breakaway can help minimize fuel spills. Remove the shear pin located in the spare shear pin location of the breakaway Install in place of the original. Torque the shear pin into 20 inch pounds. Do not over tighten. Remove the breakaway reconnection clamp. Proceed with the test outlined in section 1.4 of the Healy System Scheduled Maintenance. Inspect each half of the separator breakaway for obvious damage to the outer shell plastic insert or o-rings, including cracks, chips, or tears that may affect reconnecting the two halves. After completing inspection, lightly lubricate the main o-ring on the half of the breakaway that's attached to the hose and the two small o-rings inside the half of the breakaway attached to the nozzle. Any weight motor oil is acceptable. Remove the black handle cover from the nozzle. Slide the top clamp of the breakaway reconnection clamp above the two flat surfaces on the nozzle. Slide the half of the breakaway that's attached to the hose onto the bottom clamp of the breakaway reconnection clamp and begin squeezing the grip to slowly bring the two halves together. Align the dowel pin in the top half of the breakaway with the dowel pin guide located in the bottom half of the breakaway. When the dowel pin and guide are aligned, continue squeezing the tool grip until the breakaway halves come together. Remove the shear pin located in the spare shear pin location of the breakaway and install in the place of the original. Torque the shear pin to 20 inch pounds. Do not over tighten. If available, install a shear pin in the spare shear pin location. Remove the breakaway connection clamp. Use this procedure to either reconnect or disconnect the Healy 8701VV or 807 breakaways as part of section 1.4 procedure for reconnecting breakaway and testing fueling point after drive off in the Healy system scheduled maintenance. Note, breakaway reconnections must be logged in the GDF maintenance log.